Welcome to Goodwe Training Series. Today we will take you through the AC cable selection and installation of Goodwe Inverter. The selection and installation of AC cable of the inverter are essential for safe operation. Today, we will introduce the selection and installation of AC cables for both single-phase and three-phase Goodwe inverters. First, for single-phase inverter. 1. Cable Selection. Taking Goodwe XS as an example. As it is a single-phase on-grid unit, we need a 3-core cable. The diameter of the cross-section should be 10 to 12 mm. And the contact section area should be within 2.5 to 4 square millimeters considering the ampacity required in the system. 2. Cable Preparation. First, cut off a certain length of the internal wires from the cable. Then cut off about 10 mm of the insulation sheath of each bare wire. 3. Cable Installation. As we use fast installation AC terminal for our XS series, there are two brands of AC terminals, Vacan and ExceedCon. And we randomly include one of the brands in the package of each XS model. Here, we got the ExceedCon AC terminal. Unscrew the waterproof screw clamp, then take the terminal out. Please pay attention to the locking mechanism here. First, push the button, then rotate to unlock and pull the terminal out. Next, insert the contact section into the corresponding terminal and fix them using the screwdriver with torque 0.7 to 0.9 newton meters. Put it back to the terminal. Make sure the clamps are in the slots and lock the terminal. Tape the remaining internal wires exposed using electrical tapes. Then insert to the corresponding female end on the inverter and rotate to the lock position. Then we go to the selection and installation of the three-phase inverter. Taking Goodwe SMT as an example, for the cable selection and preparation, you can refer to the instruction on the screen or the user manual. 1. Cable Selection We need five cables including three line cables, one neutral cable and one PE cable. The diameter of the cross-section of the whole cable should be 22 to 30 millimeters. And the contact section area should be within 10 to 25 square millimeters, considering the ampacity required in the system. 2. Cable Preparation First, cut out 60 millimeters long internal bare wires from the cable. Then cut off 45 millimeters of the insulation sheath of each bare wire. If you use multi-strand copper wires, please find the AC terminal inside the accessory package, which is designed for the corresponding AC terminals on the inverter side. Then use the crimping plier to fix the AC connecting terminal onto the head of the bare wire. 3. Cable Installation Take the AC cover out of the inverter package and pass the AC cable through it. Then insert each wire into each AC terminal of the inverter, and tighten the nuts with a torque of 1.2 to 2 newton meters. The colors of the AC cables are determined by the electric codes of your country. Now we have finished the connection, then we need to lock the waterproof cover for the AC side. That's all for the AC cable selection and installation. Thank you for watching. For more installation and configuration videos of Goodwe training series, please visit our Goodwe community and stay tuned to our official account.